neighbors are describing what they heard. The morning a woman was found gunned down inside her home in Port St. Lucie. Today, police identified the victim and say she was targeted. Steve King is live outside the Town Park community with new details about the victim and the evidence found. Steve? Well, Carisha Brissett was found inside of her bedroom, dead with gunshot wounds, and 13 shell casings were found outside. Now, detectives are not saying whether that shooting and the gunfire that erupted hours before the 45-year-old were found are related. It's a horrible situation. Linda Murphy heard those gunshots early Tuesday morning in the Town Park community. I'm a light sleeper, so around 4 o'clock, I, I was kind of waking up and then I heard like pop, pop, pop. So I thought at first it was somebody just pounding on the front door for whatever reason. Right now, detectives have not said if that sound was the gunfire that killed Carisha Brissett. But right now, an autopsy is being conducted and detectives are urging neighbors with surveillance footage or any knowledge about what happened to give them a call. The possibilities are wide open at this point. We're still trying to sort out if the perpetrator knew the victim, if there was some type of relationship, we, we don't, we're in, it's too early to tell what the motivation may have been. When it happens to a neighbor, it's very alarming and it's so incredibly sad for the family, for our community. Brissette's body was found Tuesday shortly before noon after Brissette's friend went to her home to check on her because she did not show up at work. Police say her friend saw the back patio shattered and the shell casings and flagged down a delivery driver for help. That delivery driver called 911. Investigators believe the gunman shot her from outside her home, firing at Brissette through her backsliding door. Now, detectives have not said who the shooter is, but they say it's possible that the shooter walked into the neighborhood to kill Brissette. But there is an increased police presence here in the town park community. However, police say that this is just a precaution. They do not think that the shooter is in the immediate area. Reporting live in Port St. Lucie, Steve King, WPBF 25 News.